<laughs> What's up guys? This is Vargatron and I am here with the lovely Mrs. Vargatron. Hello everybody. <laughs> That's perfect. So tonight we're going to be opening up a box of 2019 Marvel Premiere. We've only got one of these so we're going to go through this and just hope that we get the best we can get out of it. Uh, check out our other videos. We've got two boxes of 2018 Fleer Ultra X-Men and another box of 2019 Marvel Flare that I'll be posting up later shortly before this video. Uh, which one of those three boxes was your best, was your favorite so far? I don't know. The second one, I think. When the we got that one? sketch card. Oh yeah, that the Jubilee, Jubilee sketch. Was, yeah, 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 yeah. That Jubilee sketch was pretty, uh, pretty sweet. So <clears throat> for those of you that don't know, the Marvel premiere set, it's, it's, one of their, well, it's their premier set. It's their most expensive set. There's only one pack of cards inside of here. Really? Um, yeah, that's it. Yeah, there's that big ass box for one oh pack of cards. Oh my gosh. Uh, this box, uh, I'm now going to let Mrs. Vargatron in on the total cost of this box for the first time. Oh God. So we'll gauge her reaction as to whether or not we'll be doing any more of these videos based off of this know. reaction. But uh, this box here costs about $240 uh, for this one pack. Uh, <laughs> she's giving me a really Oh my God, are you serious? Uh, but I got, I, got a, I got a break on it because I got it through DA Car World. So, um, like $2. Oh. So, <clears throat> we're going to cross our fingers and hope we get something really, really good in here. Oh my uh, God. I don't really keep sketches unless I really, really like the sketches. So I'm not going to say for certain that these sketches are going up, but maybe we'll see. Um, so there are 50 cards. That's it in the base set. And there are several parallels. There's a blue at 50, a red at 30, a gold at 15, a purple at five, and there's a one-on-one -on -one black. So it'd be kind of cool to pull some one-on-ones. Um, I don't really care about the other I really don't care about the other parallels because I'm never going to collect them, but it would be cool to pull a one-on-one. -on -one. Uh, there's a color box checklist, so there is um, a total of 45 cards in the color box checklist. Uh, looking forward to seeing one of those. You got the Written in the Stars set. There are, I think, 30 cards in that. And you've got, obviously, the sketch cards. You've got the booklets. The triple panels and the quad panels and then you know maybe we'll get a five by seven who knows so we're going to go ahead and open this up very carefully oh my goodness <laughs> this is somewhat ridiculous <laughs> this is the best what are you talking about all right this is actually my very first box a Marvel premiere. I've never opened a Marvel oh, premiere. Oh, well, that makes me feel so, a little bit better then. Never ones I've never a, opened one. Any Marvel I premiere, know. any of the Marvel okay. premieres. So, it's the first time with you. Makes me feel better. All right. First up. Who you're is this? You have to drop this? that. And take it out and drop it down. Oh uh, goodness. Here, let's see. We'll uh, adjust this a bit so you can see that. So that's the booklet. Looks like. Of X23. Let's go ahead and pull that out. Not bad. Oh, I see what you mean by a book. Yeah, so that, uh, that'll fold shut. That's a sketch card. And let's see who the artist is. I'm not sure who that is. Uh, Karobi? Kairobi? Not sure, but uh, not bad. Pretty good art. It's pretty. Yeah. That's not bad. It's really detailed. Let's see the front of that again. Yeah, I like that. I like the... Uh, it's very colorful. Not too much distracting in the background. I like it. That's not bad. It's not bad for a first hit. X twenty three. Do I fold it? Uh, sure. Ah. 
And so then it's the uh, size of a regular, I get regular the card idea. there. Yeah. Interesting. So show the back of that again. So X23 by Kairobi. Cut. It looks like K Y R O B H I E. If anybody knows who that is, let me know. If they're in the group, shout out. Pull one of your uh, Very cards. Cool. Very nice. One of one. Awesome. Very nice. Not All bad. Right. Not bad. So All right. Put her so over here. Go ahead and pull out I do our pack. I feel like this should be a gold pack. So look at this baby over. Does it uh, does it show the what does it show under the flap there? Does it show mm -hmm. the odds or anything of the cards? You can kind of pop it open there. What does it say there? Um Nope. Does not appear to say anything. Hmm. <laughs> Alright, well. Worthwhile. Pretty boring package. <laughs> <laughs> simple. I like they it. They put it in the packaging on the outside. Very Apparently. simple. We just want your money. That's all. That's all this is. We just want your money. Spoil Open anything. our two hundred and forty dollar pack. We don't need to talk about it. You talk about the cards. Okay. All right. Cable. It's got a cable base. I feel like I should put these over here yeah, so we don't, we don't want to reveal those spoil anything. Cable. All right. Cable. Pretty sweet. There, thicker card. All right. That's all. Forty-three out of, out of a hundred. So I'm pretty sure that's just a standard base. Yeah, that's just your standard base card. What is the six out mean of one hundred? That's card number six in the set out of fifty. Uh, so the cards are numbered one to fifty, and then this is there's only one hundred of cable number six. Uh, <clears throat> so not bad. I I expected the base card to be to come up first. So let's see what we've got next. What do we got next? Black Bolt. Black Bolt. So this is, I think, the blue variant, mm. which is out of 50. 22 out of 50. Yep. So this is the blue variant of the base set. So there's a, there's a regular base card just like that with okay. this silver, with this silver border. Uh, and these are the ones with the blue border. Oh, I see. Uh, exact same card, just different borders. I see. Very nice. Art on these are real nice. What's this? All right, you've got any written in the stars. Daredevil Libra. This is... With 22. 22, yeah, written, written in the stars. So that is... I don't know what the tiers are on these. So that's actually a tier 2. So the odds of that are 1 in 8 packs. Mm -hmm. So... So are all of these hits? Or... Yeah, I mean at this price they're all <laughs> they're all pretty much. I haven't done the hammer at all. All uh, right, last one. All right, and Oops, here is damn. Here is the sketch. <laughs> Adam Warlock. All right, we got Adam Warlock. Oh, finally. All right, who's the artist on that one? It's very nicely done. Brad Hudson. Brad Hudson. This is a one of one. So nobody else has this, right? No. Nope. Yeah. This is uh this is an original sketch card by Brad Hudson. So Brad Hudson, if you're in the group, uh awesome work, man. 
Very nice. Very nice, Adam Warlock. Again, another one with a lot of color there. It's not bad. All right, Brad Hudson. So, look at all of them again. We have the cable got base. The cable. We got black bolts, black the blue bolts, the variant. Blue parallel variant. Daredevil Libra. Written in the stars, so the shtick to these is that it's like, like if you looked up at the stars, like the character is. I don't know. You know, like when you look at the stars and they make I guess all different shapes. System. Yeah. I can show any of that on the back there. Mm -hmm. It's like uh, different shapes to make up their dough. Nice. And Adam Morlock. Adam Morlock. Very so. nice. And then. And we got the X23 booklet. Boom. Pit hammer. So that's our big boy, the X-23. That's the one to beat. <laughs> I like that one. That one's really nice. Mm -hmm. I might keep that one. Kairobi, so. Unless someone offers $240. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's it worth slightly more than $240. Oh. <laughs> I don't know. I, I honestly have no idea what these are worth. Um, I have no idea. Um, I, I'm not a sketch collector. I I grab things that I like uh, if I see them, but I am not. Uh, I don't consider myself a sketch card collector. I have some sketch cards, but just stuff. Normally, if I commission it, normally I'll commission a sketch card. I don't usually go hunting for sketches. Although, out of these last 2018 and 2019 boxes, I've been looking for sketches because I haven't been getting much else in terms of hits so um, not bad stuff pretty decent yeah. very nice very fun our first premiere box in the books and oh so oh so maybe maybe a, a another premiere box is yeah, uh... maybe it's an annual thing <laughs> <laughs> I don't think they come out annually I think they come out biannually but uh, maybe we'll do another one in two years. <laughs> maybe. Uh, so at that know. price. Yeah. So that's it. All right, guys. Uh, thanks for watching. We uh, we had a lot of fun breaking these boxes. We will have more to come. Uh, let us know how you think we did, and we are going to be doing some other fun stuff. Uh, and I'll let you know what that's going to be coming up soon. And let me know too. <laughs> I've got ideas. I've got ideas. Have All right. Good Thanks, night. guys. Good night. <laughs>